Derek, welcome to Wimbledon. Thank you, thank you very much. Good, it's good to have you here. Um, obviously, you've been training with the lads the past week. How happy are you to have earned the contract? Yeah, done deal. So I'm very happy. I've been here since Monday. I've four sessions with this one today. Very happy and just can't wait to get started with the team. Yeah, you're not exactly a stranger to English football. Obviously, you've been at Oxford and, and Walsall before. Yeah, yeah. How did you sort of come to, to come over from France to, to England in the first place? To be fair, when I was young, my dream was to come in England to play football because in England it's different. Like the culture and the football is amazing. So yeah, I'm very happy. Like the, the past season, well, I learned a lot when I was in Oxford, even in Warsaw. So yeah, I'm just happy to get back in the English football club and yeah, just ready to go. Mm. And then you come in at a time when, you know, it's the business end of the season, we've got nine games to go. What sort of Robbo said to you and the rest of the staff said to you? What's your sort of goal for between now and the end of the season? Yeah, yeah. the first goal is to integrate myself with the team and just be ready because nine games left, as you said, and the main goal is to stay in the league. So my target is to give my all every game, when I start the game, when I come off the bench and score goals and yeah, try to do my best every game. Mm. That's it, yeah. Um, what sort of striker would you say you are? Cause I know, I know you played out wide earlier in your career. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Would you say you, you prefer playing as a, a number nine, if you like? Yeah, you know, if you want to score a goal, you need to be in the box. So yeah, I prefer playing as a nine, but yeah. I can play as well on the, on the wide, like you said. So yeah, I can play both, play with feet, keep the ball, go behind, come deeper, so yeah. And then um, I was doing some digging, obviously you played for France at, at youth level. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did, you, did you play with any notable names? I'm sure, I'm sure you did in the Toulon tournament. Oh yeah, the, the, the player that I play with. Yeah. Yeah, I think uh, in the tournament of Toulon, Kylian Mbappé was in there. Ah. But yeah, I played with Kylian Mbappé, like Otton Edouard is playing now for Crystal Palace. Yeah. Yeah, and even uh, Mateta is playing as well for Crystal Palace. Yeah, many good players. Yeah, that was crazy. That was good memories. Yeah, I'm mm. proud of it. And then obviously before you came here, obviously sadly got released by Oxford. Was it quite tough to keep yourself motivated during that period between finding a new club? Yeah, of course. As a professional, you need to be to stay focused, to always be, be, believe on yourself. Sorry. So yeah, that was that was a tough period, but I always keep like working every day, keep be positive, and yeah, I, I know that one day the day will come. So I'm, I'm very happy today. I'm very happy. Yeah. Mm. I can see you've already settled in with the lads. Uh, they've already called you Del Boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Every English people call me Del Boy. I don't know why, but yeah, it's a good, it's a good nickname. It's a good nickname. Yeah. Absolutely, and and they've made you feel settled in. Sorry. The the boys have made you feel settled in. You got to know the lads. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. They they nice guy. They are young guy. Older guys as well. So yeah, they make me feel like comfortable. So yeah, I'm happy to be here. Yeah. No, talk them a bit of French yet. Yeah. Yeah, I will try to, to, to explain, to teach a little bit French, but yeah, I know it's a difficult language, but we're going to get it, you're going to get it.